Hello. Okay, I'm invisible. Okay, that that was that was quite undramatic. There we are. That's much better. I can actually see my beautiful, beautiful face. Let's start that again, shall we? Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another brand new video. And you're probably wondering, I'm on PS4 and I've got pandas. That's right. Another update has come out for Minecraft console. Well, PS4, and I haven't checked the other versions yet, but I'll have, I'll check them later on because I'm not sure if they'll get the new features. But I just wanted to make this video not only for the features, but I wanted to sort of talk about something else as well, which I'll get onto later on. But it's sort of bad news. But let's go on to the good news, shall we? This. So yeah, new update come out, and yeah, it introduces stuff like pandas, which I'll get into a, in a bit. And yeah, but. Let's start off over here with ocelots and cats. So over here I've got you know some ocelots, and I've got to get some fish out. That I'm so prepared. Like I think it's real cod. Yeah. And yet yeah, over here I've got some ocelots, and they cannot. They can be tamed, but they can't. They can't be tamed. They can just be trusted. And yeah, so they're sort of like a wild animal now, which is quite cool. And oh, they had a baby. Yeah. Okay, I did not know that. Over here we've sort of got nine different versions of cats. I I don't know if there's any more, but yeah, this is all the nine versions of cats that I could find. And I think they're all yeah, they all look pretty unique. There's like one of the old versions there, and one of the old ones there. I think they got rid of the ginger one. I'm certain because I haven't seen that. I have to check my survival world for that one. But yeah, this is all the different versions of cats, and to tame them you just just like you used to just. You know, do that. Just spam them with fish, pretty much. But obviously, in survival, they'd run away. And obviously, I'm in creative and flying. So let's just tame them all quickly. That one was a bit of a stubborn one. There we are. And as you can see, we've got collars around them. And that's quite a nice little feature as well. That they've all got collars around them. And something else that's also on the change log is phantoms. So if I change it to night quickly. There we go, easy. Phantoms should apparently be scared of cats. Let's see if that's true. Because I actually don't know. Because they're looking pretty chill at the minute. I mean, they're look yeah, they're looking pretty chilled out at the minute. Let's put them out here. Yeah, let's get this guy out, and we'll have a we'll keep. We'll have a look. You can, you can get out now. There we are. Yeah, so hopefully there should be one any second, but we won't worry about that. We'll just. But it's just in the change log, so it should work. And the next thing we've got is bamboo. Oh, yes. So this is all like a another farmable object, so. Another thing for my farming area, which update as of this day, this is the day it was released, the 18th of December. I'm still building my farm project, so and if you wanted to see how that's going, then check out my survival series link in description. <laughs> Just a little plug there. But yeah, this bamboo pretty much grows quite, it grows quite fast. And yeah, I'm not. Ah, you can bone meal it. Okay, you can bone meal it, and it grows quite tall. And if I place another one on top, I think that'd counteract. No, okay. Yes, yeah, so you can just pretty much do this and they can be placed directly next to each other. And the best bit is, you can just have it right here, just have like a flying machine. But I've got, a, I've already got a farm, like the update hasn't, hasn't been out for 10 minutes for me yet. I, like, I've only been playing around with it, like this is my first proper play around with it. And yeah, I've pretty much already got a farm farm concept and yeah this is let's talk about the things we can do with bamboo because this is pretty much like the main thing in the update so you know, you've got your bamboo there you're farming it and I'll get to how you can get it later on and if you put six of them in the furnace not furnace the crafting table with that last little bit of string you know craft that string you get six bits of scaffolding and that scaffolding is that's quite a nice meaty feature Pretty much you can just plonk yourself here to place one down 
and you just walk straight through it and sort of build your way up. Or if you stand right at the bottom here, sort of lean onto it. As you can see, I'm just placing it and it's building its way up. And I can sort of go in, hold the jump button. So for me, that's X. And then it's yeah, keep going up. There we go. I want to try go across. I'm not sure how this will work. So let's just fly, shall we? Yeah, because I think it only goes like a certain amount of blocks. Yeah, it can only go a certain amount of blocks away. So four blocks, yeah, that's a bit... That's not that good, really. So it can only go four blocks away from it. Which is sort of not that good. But I suppose it's better than nothing. But people are you know, expected to be like, right, just go around there, go around there, and then plop around. But the best thing about scaffolding is... It's all like chorus fruit in the way that if I break the bottom one, it all breaks. So that just makes it really easy to clear. So that sort of means no more dirt pillars, which is which is really good. And yeah, that's scaffolding. It sort of looks like a nice little table as well, doesn't it? Right. So yeah, let's move on to the other use of bamboo, which is also another cause of it get a way of getting it because you can get it by fishing or like. Imagine chests somewhere, or pandas. Yes, if I break all this, what happened? Where'd I get a baby panda? Oh my god, I'm so sorry, panda. I'm so sorry. Oh my goodness, I'm punching a panda. Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry. Yes, I, I've no idea how to get these into love mode. I've tried a fish. That I've tried because it said something to do with bamboo, but it just does, it's not. It's not doing anything, and he was just looking straight up. Well, what are these two doing? Okay, yes, yeah, so I don't know how to get a baby panda yet because that'd be quite a cool one to have. And this guy, okay, that's pretty weird. That's pretty weird, but now. We're going to have to kill one to get the bamboo. That's also another way to get... That's also another way to get the bamboo. They just... They drop one bit. Just... There we go. Just... No witnesses. There we go. That's the best way. See so yeah, they... They drop, I think, one bit of bamboo each per... So to start a bamboo farm, all you need is a single panda. So you kill a panda. And then place the bamboo down. And you can start farming it. And then you can breed up more pandas. There you go. So there is a few bug fixes in here as well. But before I get to that, there's one more feature which I actually forgot about, which is just around here, which is the dyes. See, so yes, I've added new dyes to this game. You've got your black dye, your blue dye, your brown dye, and your white dye. And it's just crafted from ink sacks, lapis, cocoa beans, and bone meal, which is you know quite a quite a handful to get. Because they can still be used for the dyes, but they're quite easy to get. But yeah, with this you can still you can dye you know the cat's collars and yeah. So that's quite a cool one now. And yeah, we've got a pink sheep over there that I found naturally. That's not update related though. And this is my test world, just so just so you know. Got some secret projects working on, Gold Farm. YouTube tutorial. Not me. Not my design. But yeah. I'm gonna quickly hop over the bug fixes now because there are quite a few like crashes when going to snow bite like layered snow and stuff like that. But there's one that sort of there's one important one which is bad news, so I'm gonna quick get that sorted and I'll catch you in a bit. Well in a second when I've loaded up that world. Okay, so there's another bug fix sort of saying that something about well okay, you're talking about that it's fixed something to do with the tutorial world and the barrier block video which I made which is so I'm just going to quickly test it for you know for real but it did say in the tutorial in the change log that it has fixed this issue well they call it an issue but I'd call it you know pretty cool feature really quite a nice secret feature but with the barrier blocks and obviously to get them you'd come down here and pick block this lava and apparently it still works okay it still works 
apparently. It literally says in the change log. I'll quick. I'm quick gonna read the change log because. Okay, quick disclaimer. I was gonna end the video, but you know, quick disclaimer. If you load up tutorial world before this update, it'll work. But I've just loaded up a brand new one. Just you know, just a brand new story world in this update, and there is not a barrier block here. See, I can I can place blocks here and everything. So it does not work, but it works in old creative, old, it works in old story world basically. In new loaded ones, no. Just a quick disclaimer for you. But yeah, that is going to be the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, leave it a thumbs up and I'll see you all next time. See ya.